Hi there YouTubers, um, I found something very annoying about the HTC Cha Cha Dismiss. So, basically, what the fact is, um, the, the problem I have is trying to turn off the mobile network. Um, I'm cooking my dinner, so I apologise. But, um, so, there's, there's no, no settings here in the notification bar on Android like there used to be on a bigger screen. And they've took that away to save space for when your notifications come in. So you can't turn off your mobile internet or anything like that. To turn off your mobile internet, there's two ways. You can either press menu and then go to settings, then go all the way to wireless and network, and then go down to the bottom to turn your mobile network off. Sorry, I've got a really runny nose today. Or you could go to the first page, go to the apps, go to settings and turn it off that way. But I got really frustrated, so I went into the Android Market or Play Store and found this little widget here. This little widget, you tap it, I'm not going to tap it, but you tap it and it turns mobile internet on or off. So, what you do is you tap and hold on the home screen, you go to widgets, this is once you've downloaded it, and then it's data enabler. So, if I go to the Play Store, um D A T A E. There it is, data enabler. You just type that in and go to all apps, and it's the first one. Um, I know there's no macro, so I apologise. So on the Play Store, App Store, whatever you want to call it, Market or whatever, Android Market sounds better. You just install it. So it's amazing because it allows you to turn off your mobile internet to save data. If you've only got like 500 mega data and you don't want to use it all up, you can turn it off by just tapping that and it turns it off. Bloody brilliant. I use it all the time. So it's a widget to toggle data enabled settings, no modifications to APM, uh, no wait to reconnect. No, this is a widget. Please add from home page the home screen so you've got to add it um, it's been it's got really good reviews um, how do I review it here um, it's really good rating review five star title best app ever best what it jet for turning off Okay, I've just said best app, but it's just simple because you can turn data on and off, no problem, really easy. So it's just a bit of a tip to turn your mobile data on and off. If if you just add it to your home screen, and um, also another one which I recommend is this battery widget that. And I know there's no macro, I apologise. I wish I had a camera with macro, but... So basically, with that, you can t turn off battery, display, GPS, Wi-Fi, and Bluetooth, but there's no mobile data in that one. That's just a battery percentage widget, so go to the Play Store, type in battery, battery, with it, jet, press enter, battery widget. It, it is the first one. It, the picture looks different, than what it actually is, but this one's the best. These are just my recommendations for this phone, and for any Android, really. Um, so there's just pictures of it. You see, that's what it actually looks like. It's just a little battery. Sorry you can't see that very well. And um, we'll go back. So just type in battery widget, and it's the one with that little symbol there, if you can see it. And then once you've done that, get off, I don't want to go in the picture. These pictures are of the old first Android when it first came out. Not they've, they've not been updated. I'm going to rate that. Great app. Best app for seeing how much the battery life you have left left in percent so just rating these apps because they are just super so the two best apps there's loads of different versions of this battery widget one 
different people created and you got the battery gauge if you want a gauge but for my personal preference I recommend the first one I've just showed you so, so you get the battery gauge and uh, which looks like this I've got auto rotate turned off but you can have different gauges you see like, like a car so like a fuel gauge you can tell you if you've got any power or not so um, it goes up and down it goes so it is really good, but I prefer the first one, the battery widget. And so, so the two best apps so far that I've found, well, widgets, should I say, is the battery percentage widget and the data enabler widget. This bar at the top comes free with Android, comes pre-installed. So that only enables Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, GPS, sync, and the brightness. It doesn't enable mobile data. So I was very frustrated, I'm like, do I have to keep going into the settings every time I want to turn my mobile later off? So I thought, well, let's look for a widget. And I was looking and looking and looking and looking and looking under different names and I couldn't find a data enable a widget until now. And then I found it and I'm like, oh yes, I love it. Don't delete it, I love it. Um, so yeah, this is in the HTC Touch Air, just showing you my two best apps that I found so far. If you've enjoyed this video, please give it a like and a thumbs up. Well, that's the same thing, and a favourite, or whatever, yeah, um, comment and subscribe, thank you for watching, there'll be more videos about the HTC Chat Chat as I get used to it, I've been using it for a day, so thank you for watching, and peace out, I don't want to swear, sorry.